same uh, sure nerve gas, but ten times, at least ten times more powerful. So the Novichok agents are uh, a, a group of agents. We call them fourth generation chemical weapons, and they were developed by the Soviet Union in the 1980s. Uh, Sarin and VX are third generation chemical agents. This is a more advanced fourth generation agent, and it's more lethal. It's about at least five times more deadly than VX, which is one of the most deadly chemical agents. It can be a, a fine powder or a liquid, so because it, it didn't knock them on their feet immediately, uh, it seems that it was some type of uh, contact with their skin that probably was the method of transmission. One other fact about the Novichok agents is that they're not prohibited specifically on a list by the Chemical Weapons Convention. Um, in fact, they were developed by the Soviet military to evade our uh, defenses, our protective suits, our antidotes, and also to, uh, as a way to be able to, to produce them without being covered by the Chemical Weapons Convention. Really two scenarios. One is that this was a Russian government operation to kill this uh, you know, former uh, spy that they consider a traitor even though he's in the UK. So that's one possibility. The second possibility is that it was in a Russian laboratory and somehow they lost control of it. There is concern that some of the chemical formulas have become publicly known, so it's possible that other countries would have uh, ventured into the, the, these, uh, this class of chemical uh, weapons agents.